Hello YouTube, Quirky Dutch Guy here, playing Dyson Swear Program. Uh, this game came on my wishlist saying it was available and I was like, yeah, let's buy it. Uh, I was looking at it for some time now and it's a very interesting concept. It's kind of a Factorio uh, combined with uh, Satisfactory. Both games I own and uh, before I'm playing this I played uh, Factorio, creating my own mega base, which is a very lovely experience. For now we are going to play Dyson Square program. Uh, I did play a couple of hours so I know the basics a little bit so yeah let's uh, start and let's uh, do our things. Uh, well I don't care, uh, usually with uh, Factorio I up the resource multiplier a little bit uh, just for the sake that um, it's, it's nice that way. Um, I mean I haven't experienced any of these other uh, systems yet so uh, basically what I could do in my last playthrough was I could fly, that was it. And then I thought you know what let's make a video. Okay. Uh, Welcome to the actual universe. For those who want to see uh, you the intro, the prologue, uh, go watch another video. Yeah. Here this we is Icarus, are. a lightweight industrial mech so. with powerful functionality. You can use First the off, I love the game. Right it's on looking the very to beautiful, its very colorful. In this and, mission, uh, you will yeah. manipulate Icarus uh, to travel beyond my little stars robot right and here. create miracles. It's, uh, it's a little bit flat. Uh, you know, if you look at it from here, you used to think it's a big, big robot, and then you look at it from the side, and you're now like, try to recycle the space you capsule. land on your stomach a little right bit too big. On it to recycle. Yeah, let's do that. So, uh, we have to recycle this one, and uh, get you can some use trees the same as well. Uh, trees are the base such as fuel trees, for the gravel, machine. Etc. Uh, right now, we don't have In any the meantime, fuel, so hold down everything shift goes and right very slow. To give a series of commands. And, uh, you receive several items after recycling so the space capsule. Click the inventory button in the lower right corner of the screen to open the cabin to view them. Let's get ourselves a little bit of this. This is iron ore. You got a few things so far. I know you got iron ore. You got uh, the uh, copper ore. You got stone. You got oil. You also got uh, titanium ore and stuff like that. But uh, I couldn't find it anywhere. And then I got the message that it wasn't on this uh, planet. You sometimes, can hold down mouse middle button drag uh, to rotate the angle when of you view, pick up this, or slide the mouse uh, wheel to zoom get, in uh, and out. You get titanium ore like here. Titanium ore. We can't use it just yet, but uh, we will. Uh, let's get ourselves some fuel. Then things will speed up a little bit. So we got. Uh, we need to research the first thing here. So let's do that. And I think I can't make that just yet. I can make 10. Awesome. So let's keep on doing this then. So let's see what the world is like. like that, that is stone and that is cool. That's nice. We got our copper vein here, which is nice as well, obviously. All right, first thing is done. I believe you get. You have created a mining machine first. to achieve yeah, ore collecting automation. So, are to rotate the, the button. Uh, the buttons are very much like uh, Factorio, which I quite like. You can like, use the R honest. key to rotate the uh, mining the e machine for covering uh, more this veins. And, uh, the more veins covered, the faster the ores will the way, be but, gathered. But, yeah. If you want to ignore grid snapping, so try holding down the shift key. Some power. So let's do so. Here we go. Wind turbine. For now, we have you to have build. You have established uh, your first power cells. grid. Not all power facilities has yet. its power I mean, supply area. To have copper, Use the Tesla so tower to extend the area of right the Right now, we can grid. just bunny up like that. But um, you know, the flying itself is fun. I will say that. So here we have the uh, technologies and the upgrades for the Mac. Uh, quite a lot, to be honest. And uh, also here, uh, quite a lot. Um, the first thing we are going to do is, um, well, I do want to have the smelters. Yeah, let's go and get the smelters. 
and then we'll get this one the uh, basic logic so that we have conveyor belts that's good um, now I am uh, creating a few extra miners just to have a few it's, uh, how many do I have right by the way I need to create a few more all right so let's get my bearing here so we want to do it like this then like so and maybe here as well uh, like so all right it is created so I mean, you have these little robots that create stuff. They are very slow right now. Uh, they will uh, uh, become better at some point. Uh, but for now, they're kind of You have of done building the first power transmission facility, Tesla Tower. It can carry out short distance wireless power transmission and expand the power uh, supply area gosh. of the power grid. Click on it to view the current power grid information. Hmm. You know what? Let's uh, remove that. So. That was a bit too much. How many can we make? We need iron as well. Give me your four, thank you. And we are walking very, very slow, but in time uh, we will get faster. So we'll create let's say a few we'll create a few. Yeah. let's see what do we need for the research we need 10 of these and all of these I can create 10 that's lovely stuff and we need to create 10 of these as well so we need to have a little bit more ore let's say Iron is always important in each and every of these games. I mean, as soon as we can, we are going to automate this. Uh, just for the sake that uh, we are probably going to need a lot of these and a lot of these. I know for a few things you need it. For research, you need both of them. For the red research, you have uh, multiple colors, just like in Factorio. Um, there's one thing maybe a few but uh, like in factorio you have this a certain edge especially on death world uh, where you need to have a defense uh, you know otherwise you will be overrun by uh, the little creatures you don't have that so in this case it's just building and creating your own uh, creativity and do what you want uh, you know i'm not really i usually do not really like that uh, however, this game is so far keeping me uh, to it that I want to explore more. I, I want to go out there and uh, visit, uh, visit different worlds and see well how it is right there. I mean, that's a big ass moon. Uh, yeah. I mean, basically this is my system so we have oops we have a few there we have Shumali one all right uh, yeah that's pretty far away and there we have that one all right anyhow we're nearing oh here now we have to uh, quickly cut a tree uh, otherwise we will be slowed I like that system by the way so now we have the smelters so what I was saying will make the smelters like probably like here or something yeah why not so how many smelters can we make we can make five and we will make five nope. I would love it if they would, uh, you know, if you press shift and click, then uh, it adds like two or maybe five uh, uh, to the total number. Now you have to press this button 
uh, 10 times to create 10. So you can also uh, press 10 times on this button. That doesn't really matter then. So, yeah. So we are going to smelt a few things. Um, again, this is uh, with all these games, uh, how do you uh, go about? So, uh, let's say. There. Here we go. We'll create two of these there. You built a smelter, which can and smelt basic materials. Let's go in the same direction. And copper ingots automatically. Like so. While you want to make Always slow in these games uh, at the start, but as soon as you get something up and running, uh, you usually uh, are like, ah, this is easy. I do love the the way the the buttons here at the uh, blow sides it's like you press two and then you got these button and in this case i will press f1 and i have this so very you know you can do everything from there and that's a new way of uh, interacting with the uh, hot to be honest for me at least so i'm back you can now uh, click the planet I haven't thumbnail built button very much but this is something or press the yeah, M key well, to try nice the planet system. view mode. Uh, you know, you have this little thing right here and that uh, holds the stuff in and with this it holds it out. So whichever direction you put it to, uh, it goes in. It has uh, three inputs here uh, at this moment, three places that you could place it. Uh, so we'll con uh, connect it to here and uh, we will connect it you can't connect it there because there's no belt so we will do this uh, like i said at this moment my little uh, helpers are very very <laughs> very slow so yeah but i like that uh, a thing is uh, if you put your uh, conveyor belt in one direction you cannot change it to go to the other uh, to the opposite direction also i don't know how to pick stuff from the belts that is quite annoying to be honest so yeah but we are creating our first uh, iron here which is uh, very lovely and i've got a storehouse right here and uh, which is something i will build obviously um you because built a storage, uh, which can be used to store cargo. Uh, also, you can manually one, store or use the yeah. sorter to automatically so, stock the cargo. Anyhow, while I am uh, cutting all these things, uh, the game also has, uh, well, uh, some sort of exploration uh, of your own world. I mean, for now, I will not explore because I'm very, very slow. Uh, but um, as soon as you get some speed in these legs, yeah, you know, explore the world. I mean, it's a lovely world. And what I really love is, I don't know why, but uh, the sun will come uh, and will rise somewhere. And uh, it's nice. It's a beautiful sight, to be honest. So, yeah. Okay, now let's create this one and let's finish this one as well. Like if I want to go this way because I want to, you know, uh, align it to the building. Now I have to go here, and yeah, that's kind of annoying, to be honest. So uh, let's say it like that. Uh, we want to go from here to there. So it's taking a lot of time to build, but yeah, I hope it's worth it makes it handier if you want to have stuff right uh, boom, boom, boom. so we need the intakes there we go like so we are creating copper that is lovely stuff there we go lovely 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 you gotta love it right that's why uh, we play these games i will go for this then we can create uh, these roads or these conveyor belts uh, automatically yeah that's a good thing but maybe if I think about it uh, I should probably hmm <sighs> yeah uh, let's uh, create a few more how many roads uh, uh, conveyor I keep saying roads uh, conveyor belts so Let's make a few. Um, yeah. So 
so we need a lot of these gears we are not creating that but um, that's also you know what maybe maybe cancel this and make 10 of those and 10 of these as well so this is a part of the main quest and it's a long main quest so yeah and at the end you need all these colors to uh, finish this one and then you need white it's that is exactly like factorio <laughs> and it's like uh, you start uh, with one color you start with red and then you get the greens and then you get the blue and the yellow and the purple and uh, then you uh, launch a rocket with a satellite on board and then you get your white research i wonder if this is uh, about the same but yeah uh, hang on we can't do that because we don't have research yet uh, so we need this first all right let's uh, let's go for that uh, I can also get a personal upgrade which is probably nice uh, also a thing what I would love to see is that uh, if I would click this and I would drag it over that that it gets priority over that right now it doesn't get that so yeah uh, but we were uh, we want to have a few of these assemblers we can make four we will make four then um, you know uh, planning ahead maybe right over there we can make the research something like that I mean we can also create it here obviously but um, yeah let's just do that like so boom boom and then again oh wait oh wait oh wait no no <laughs> okay it's all here okay it's all here uh okay now we have the research building which is lovely oh it has to go there okay um but we are going to create our first uh, thingy, uh, whatever its name is. Um, what do we want to create? We want that, so we need the cogs, so we need those. And then we are just going to do it like so. And we need power. Obviously we need power. No, we don't want that. We want this and then we connect this to there and this to there you need that yeah lucky stuff and then we need a storage facility which we don't have unfortunately and we need stone all right let's uh, uh grab it i mean there was stone here somewhere uh, where was it? I don't know. But look at this. This is uh, the sun is coming up from somewhere. I don't know where, but uh, probably from there. And it's a it's a nice sight, right? Ah, oh, there is the sun. Yeah, it looks beautiful. I mean, the game is absolutely beautiful. And also from uh, a game developer's uh, point of view, I think it's very smart what they did. Uh, everything is uh, a cube. So there aren't a lot of uh, pixels uh, or a lot of, uh, I don't know the English word for that, uh, vertices uh, on screen uh, by doing it like this. Uh, yeah, well, whatever. Uh, so we can create one, you say. Uh, well, good thing I'm here. So, how many can we create now? We can create 19. Well, we are going to need a couple of these because I am uh, usually use a lot of these. And then we will do like so. There we go. And hook that up. We don't need that much to be honest. So, we'll just do like this. Maybe if I was doing it correctly, I would put a storage there and uh, ah crips this is not possible like so then okay. 
Okay, like let's remove that. Uh, can I create this here? Yeah, I can. And we have to do it like this then. Um, should I? Nah, who cares, right? Here we go, here we go, and here we go. No, don't, no, stop. You will go like this. Uh, ah, nice, we got more energy. How is my energy doing? It's, it's bad, it's bad, yeah. So let's cut this tree quickly. Here we go. I mean, this is a bell. Uh, maybe first thing we will do is go to that uh, coal patch somewhere. Let's create our energy from here. So we'll just pick a few here. We'll create this right here. And oh. this uh, from there and right there yes like so and then some energy for the boys there you go and uh, this will just you know for when I really need the energy I can just grab it from here like so and then we can give myself some energy and let's also do this let's uh, so my energy problem is sort of uh, fixed, uh, not really, obviously, but sort of. Hey, this is uh, this is uh, oil. This is nice. All right, let's keep on trucking, shall we? You know, like where shall I put it? Uh, where is the best location? You know what? I'm done with that. So let's just put it here. Let's give it some energy. Matrix Lab. You yes. can use it to make super matrices yes. or research technologies that require them to unlock. The super matrices are the source code of the center brain for maintaining the home world. You can upload as many super matrices to the center brain as possible. You can be benefit to unlock more actual world technologies by operating the home world simultaneously. Yeah, that's something I love. Uh, but uh, in this case, you can create this, or you can say that a building like that should be uh, researching. And uh, then you can say, ah, uh, you have to research. Then it will uh, use these blue things, uh, which will make, uh, which other buildings will create. So right now I'm saying uh, create this. Um, to be able to create that blue thing, we need um, the magnets, these ones and these ones. So that's what we are going to create right now. We are going to automate this as well. Uh, what do we need for this one? Already? Yeah, so this is lovely as well. We'll make two of these, then I'm out, probably. Uh, we can create nine. We will do so, we can't create any of that, that's okay. Uh, no storage, there's nothing in storage. Yeah. That's, uh, yeah, doesn't work like that then, does it now? So, let's uh, don't create that. Create this. And we'll set it up like, and then we output right here, we output right here. I could also make it that it goes right here and right here and then outputs there. Could also do that as well. And there's no input or something. No, it's not inputting here, oh, like so. And it needs this as well. So, oh. I mean, this is kind of stupid, actually, that I built from uh, out of the storage. Usually, you would make it on this belt, but I don't ha yet, just yet, have the um, conveyor uh, splitter. So, yeah, that's uh, that's too bad, actually. Uh, now, the energy is kind of low. We'll just grab a little tree right here, and. Uh, 
like, you know, why, why should I? I want to have that. And let's walk to the coal and let's get some extra coal. And while you play this, um, you're constantly thinking, okay, what is the best thing for me to do, right? Uh, what do I need? Uh, how much time and effort will go into that? Uh, that's also a thing. And um, you have to keep in mind that this game takes up a lot of your time. So be, be prepared. Uh, what I'm going to do is kind of weird actually, but I am going to grab that and bring it down here. I have to be here because my little robots are making this. Like, yeah, kind of annoying that they are <laughs> this slow, but yeah, can't do uh, shit about it. So we are here right now, so we can connect this to there. And what I am going to do is say create this. So now it's creating the blue things and uh, that's lovely and you can pick it like this obviously but now you need another lap so we have to create another lap here and obviously i don't have the uh, building materials for it so we'll just put this one then how far can we go here not that far uh, let's uh, do it like this then let's put it uh, i can also uh, get it directly out of this uh, storage facility, but you know, so this is good as well. So we have one left, so we have to create more of these as well. Uh, we have to automate this as well, obviously. And now uh, we're not doing that, and we say, no, do the research. So if everything goes well, here yeah, it's filling, and right here you can see if it had energy. Ah, yeah, obviously that's my bad. I should connect it to the grid, so like so. How's the energy now? We are not really doing well, but uh, but it's now working. You know, I'm not doing anything; it's just working on it. So, what I can do, however, is say, you know what? I'll grab 13 and 14, and uh, then I will help uh, right here. Uh, what we also can do is stack stuff. This is, I mean, I love that, and uh, this will uh, greatly enhance uh, the speed of uh, things obviously and uh, yeah so uh, you can click on it and to see if this one has 19 versus 6 do we have a couple more we are not creating enough of these magnets I see so we have to see why we are not creating enough this one is not building because this is kind of slow I think yeah that's the problem because this one is doing it it's fairly slow so we are gonna change this and say you know what connect to it directly like so then we'll, do, we'll use the storage later because we kind of need more of this stuff now it's going to be probably yeah it's not really fast i reckon we can make another two here no you see this is the wrong uh the wrong direction so you can uh, uh f yourself pretty hard with that so I mean the building itself is very uh, very quickly it's very nice how to build stuff and uh, it's easy and uh, everything uh, yeah it goes fairly quick uh, to be honest as well so well I mean these robots are kind of slow but 
you know, to make the blueprint, uh, if you will. And that's qu kind of quick, yeah. So, hopefully we'll make more and uh, that will go quicker now. And limit that to there. You know what, I will say for now to one space that everything uh, just follows along. And this one is okay. We are creating uh, plenty more right now. Now the gulf is coming. Yeah. Now we are going to see it filled up. There's a two, three, four. Uh, it has to be quicker. We have to up our game a little bit, maybe. Well, it's going up. It's, it's doing okay, I reckon. I found some oil, by the way. Oil is also for uh, for him. So let's put it just right there. Uh, we are progressing still, uh, you know, w all the time I was building that right there, I'm doing uh, stuff like this as well. So, how are we going? Yeah, I mean I love this system, I would love to have this. Now, now we're talking. So, we get the splitter, which is lovely. And you get the uh, Sorter MK2, and that is a little bit uh, faster, which is nice. Uh, now we are building the drive engine so that we can fly a little bit, and that's yeah. I mean, I like that. Yeah, I mean, in all, uh, all honesty, the first time I took off, I was like, yeah, this is amazing. So yeah, we need to have a little bit, uh, a few more coal. I see because here we have uh, we need uh, 100 something so we have enough right now and we need a few more of those uh, magnets as well this is uh, the third level isn't uh, going with this one yes but with this one no so we can do two things either create another one of these or we create these uh, we don't have the electric motor that is too bad. We can't. We don't. No. Okay. So we have to uh, do that. Uh, shift click uh, uh, is. Uh, if you shift click something, you can uh, split it. Uh, lovely stuff here on the right side. It says all the options you can do, and uh, quite lovely actually. Uh, yeah, I like that. Okay, so I spotted the problem, where the problem lays or lies, and that is right here. Oh. What happens? That's right here. So we need more of these units, and we will create that. Uh, uh, oh, we have a few. No. Let's uh, do it like this, like that. Can I do it? Yeah, all right. So, like so, and like so, and it doesn't have energy. That is actually too bad. Let's create it right there. That it has energy, and now we will get plenty of these things. How to go this way? Here. Now we can fly, which is lovely. I like it. That saves a lot of time. Uh, you have received the ability to fly. There we go. Double click the space key to lift off. We're flying. And then use the arrow keys to control mecha movement. The moving speed will increase by 150% yeah. with more energy like consumed under flight mode. Pressing the alt key can return the mecha to the ground during the flight. So let's build that right there. So like so. Lovely stuff. Uh, yeah. For first time base, uh, how are we doing right now? Right here. This is uh, quite okay, I believe. I think we need more of these, by the way. I mean, yeah, we definitely need more. And we need this stacked ASA because uh, I don't want to create stuff myself. Uh, so what is the problem here? Let's do a little quick thing. It is probably either uh, not enough power, obviously. Uh, yeah, power is uh, it's a part of the game, obviously. Oh, and it's in the uh, it's part of the game. How are we doing on power now? 
still not very good. I mean, I'm creating a lot of these. How do we do? How do we fail power now? Not good. So what we have to do is find uh, uh, a way uh, to where is it? Thermal power, right here. We want that, and we will do that on a later moment. Yeah. But we want the thermal power. That's and now we fly. Yeah. Well, it doesn't really matter, but if you are depleted, you will just land. So, uh, that's the thing, where am I going to put the whole energy grid? Okay, there we go, we were awfully slow there. You know, you have to think about these things. But now my energy right here at the bottom, uh, I wanted to fly up, I couldn't because I didn't have the energy for it and now I can, but now I didn't, so I, have, I fall down. Thermal power, which is lovely, uh, thermal power does help pretty much, uh, so we are just going to place one right here, it needs uh, coal obviously. A thermal power station. Such power facilities need to consume chemical energy fuels. Like so. If you and wanted to generate continuous and power. stable power, yeah. you need to ensure that all three of supply are working right now. Uh, this one isn't working because it's uh, a manual research, and uh, I can't make that by the way. So screw that, and let's do something different. Uh, what shall we do? Let's do the steel smelting. Yeah, why not? So now it's working. And we see that we have uh, a lot of these as well, so we can pick up a few and help the whole research. So yeah, so uh, yeah, this is my base right now, and we can go pretty high. We cannot go outer space just yet, I believe. No, oh, the powers. Well, there's no damage. Uh, I didn't have any energy. Sorry, uh, but yeah. Without further ado, I think I will leave you guys uh, here uh, with this. Uh, thank you for watching. Uh, I really love this game. Uh, I must say, uh, when I played it solo last time, uh, I enjoyed it. But you know, I, I need the uh, the I'm on the edge of uh, can I survive this and how will I survive this and. I need that so I hope they will create something like that and also if it would be multiplayer it would be so much better to play this with a friend I mean this is a multiplayer game uh, that's all I can say and uh, I hope they will create that the roadmap they are uh, working on the roadmap so maybe it's in the roadmap I hope they uh, will make that for now for what I see this is like out of the box uh, uh, an alpha game uh, uh, and it's so much better than all the other uh, alpha games I played before the beta what is it uh, but early access let's call it like that um, this is such a good early access game uh, it it works right for me it works and it connects and you know sometimes you uh, you play an early access game and you have a lot of bugs and stuff like that I I must say I haven't found many bugs at this moment actually maybe one or two maybe and uh, but yeah it's very good so I have uh, big faith in these developers and um, hopefully uh, in the in the in the future they will uh, bring the multiplayer and a few other things but we'll get to that in uh, a second video if I would make one Anyhow, thank you for watching if you got this far and hope you have a good day and uh, take care. All right. Bye bye.